Well, cases of COVID-19 are also soaring in other parts of the world, with some countries seeing more cases than they did in the spring. In Turkey, the virus is surging. The country recorded 32,000 new cases in a single day on Thursday. Authorities are imposing tough measures on the weekends, including a curfew and a full lockdown. France 24's Jasper Mortimer has more from Ankara. The government imposed a partial lockdown on November the 20th, and 10 days later, it tightened those measures. Now, from Monday the 23rd of November through to Wednesday this week, that's 10 days in a row, the number of people dying each day rose to a record high. On Wednesday, it reached 193 people die, dead, just for the one day. On yesterday, Thursday, the, it, the number of people who died dropped marginally to 187. But basically, this daily rise in the death toll to a record high indicates that the government is failing to get a grip on the situation. Now, the Turkish Medical Association and opposition politicians have been calling on the government to impose a full lockdown for at least two weeks. The Medical Association thinks the lockdown should go on for maybe three weeks. But the government has been reluctant to do this, one, because such a lockdown would have an effect on the economy, and two, it doesn't want to be seen to be giving in to the opposition. But the consequences are the figures are rising and we don't seem to be able to get a handle on them. Jasper Mortimer there.